Hey guys, what is up? It is Charlo here, and I just got back from seeing Deadpool 2. I loved it. I thought it was freaking hilarious. I'm gonna make a spoiler free review for the first half of this video, and then the second half will be all spoilers, so I'm warning you now. Stay for, stay for like halfway through the video, and if you want to sp sp be spoiled, go, feel free to watch the second half of the video, but if you don't want to be spoiled, watch the first half. And if you want to go see Deadpool 2 and then come back to this video, that's fine with me. And watch and see the spoilers. Okay. So we're going to talk about the things I liked about Deadpool 2, the things I didn't like, my opinions, and all that. So, I loved Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool, like in the first one. I actually, I kind of owned the first one, and I'm actually borrowing it from my friend, because I'm supposed to see it with my girlfriend, because she hasn't seen the first one. Anyway, I loved Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool. I thought he was really freaking hilarious. Loved all the fourth wall breaks. You expect that with Deadpool. Loved, loved um, Josh Brolin as um, Cable, even though he did play Thanos, which... I'll talk about Thanos in a minute in after this. I loved um I don't know the actress's name, but I love um Domino Domino she was pretty cool. Peter was awesome. Not gonna say what happens to X Force. I will so we'll tell about that in the spoiler review. Um, I really liked um the kid who who has fire powers. Uh, fire st fire fist was his name. Um, red re I forget what his name was, but whoever the kid was, I really liked him. He was pretty good, and I loved Cable. Um, Duke Pender returns, like, he's in the first one. The Taxi Driver. That was great. I'm wearing a Rick and Morty shirt, I just realized. I should have get a Deadpool shirt. Anyway, yeah. The Dead I love Deadpool, loved all the action. The first opening scene was great. And, yeah, it was awesome. Like, I might go see Deadpool again. Deadpool 2 again. And as soon as the first, the second one comes out on Blu-ray, I'm buying it because I loved it. My thumb really hurts, I just realized. It might be broken, but I don't think it is. It's, it's cracking a little bit. But anyway, Deadpool 2 was great. Loved it. 9.5 out of 10. I originally I was going to give it an 8 out of 10, but then I thought about it more. I'm like, I could give it a 9.5 out of 10. My friend Jonah, who I saw it with, said he gave it an 8 out of 10. It was so funny. There were so many fourth wall jokes. It was insane. I couldn't even keep track of how many jokes were there, there were, but it was insane. Like I legit loved it. Like, I might. I'm definitely going to see it again with my girlfriend. I'm actually gonna do that soon. But like, oh my god, I cannot wait to see this movie again. And like, I'm leaving this on my shelf again. Deadpool two was great. I loved it. I'm gonna start talking about spoilers pretty soon because I want to get to the good stuff. So um, it's not only five minutes. Yes, I'll wait until it's five minutes. But then once it's five minutes, I'll talk. I'll start talking about spoilers. We're around like the six minute mark. I was talking about spoilers, but uh, it was great. Loved it. I cannot wait for the uh, second one or the third one. They're gonna make a third one. Obviously, they're gonna make a third one. The second one did so well. They're obviously gonna make a third one. And like, the only movie I gotta go see now is Solo. I've heard it's dying. Great review, not really great reviews, but I'm still gonna see it since I'm a Star Wars fan. And my girlfriend is a huge nerd like I am, so she loves Star Wars as much as I do. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna see that again. And, like, ugh. I did really like Josh Brolin as Cable. I thought I wouldn't like him for some reason, but I actually loved him. And Blind Al did return in this movie. I forgot to mention that. Uh, Blind Al did return. She was awesome. She was pretty good. Um, I like, like, I'm actually not going to talk about that scene because that's a, technically a spoiler. So I'll talk about it in the spoiler half of this video as soon as it hits the six-minute mark. But, yeah, Deadpool 2 was great. I'm probably going to see it at least three times. My friend Jake wants to see it, but he's coming back from California, I think, soon. And yeah, Deadpool 2 was oh, freaking amazing. I laughed my ass off in every scene. It was so funny. Excuse my language, by the way. But oh my god, I love Deadpool 2. Oh my god. It was the best. Like, literally. I can go on and on about this movie. It was great. And like, I, I just like, oh my god. I'm not going to talk about spoilers yet because it's not hit six minutes. But once I do... Be, be, brace yourself, because there'll be a bunch of spoilers. Some heavy stuff. And oh yeah, Colossus and Negasonic Teenage Warhead return in this movie. I don't think I mentioned that. They were in the first one. I think they were in the trailer, so I think that's what you had to expect. They were both pretty good. Colossus was hilarious. Um, there's a certain CGI character who I'm not going to talk about right now, because it's a spoiler, so I'll talk about my own spoiler review. But he was pretty awesome, that CGI character. And yeah. And there's a few... Spoilers I want to talk about, and I'll start talking about them around the 
six minute mark so yeah it's just about five minutes so i might as well start talking about it now so yeah let me go my, go, let me go get my she wherever down all the spoilers don't fall phone don't fall so record all my, all my videos on my phone okay ow step in my shoe um okay deadpool spoilers here we go there's a in the beginning of the movie there's a scene when deadpool is killing every like a kill montage kind of like in john wick i've never even seen john wick i should probably should get on that Gotta go see John Wick. So there's a um, scene in the, f in the beginning when Deadpool kills a bunch of guys. He dressed up like a stripper, stripper, which is really funny. And there's a scene when a bunch of enemies find him and Vanessa's girlfriend, their apartment. And he, Vanessa ends up dying. She gets killed. And Deadpool, like, kills the guy. And then in, in the beginning, or in the end of the movie, I know this is a skip, uh, spo Spoiler for the ending, but like Deadpool dies saving Russell. That was the name Russell. I forgot his name, but now I know his name. Russell. All right, so Deadpool does. He sacrifices himself so Russell can live, but then Cable using his timey you want me watch thingy goes back in time, and then like saves Deadpool, which I really liked. There's a scene with Juggernaut. That's the CGI character that I was mentioning before. With there's a fight between him and Colossus. CGI fight. CGI one with Colossus was. Or not classes. Juggernaut was meh. The, the uh, Juggernaut class wasn't the, 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 the Colossus CGI wasn't that bad. And um, after Deadpool recruits X Force, they all die. They all die except for Download because Download's power is luck. But then I love the scene when um, Deadpool goes back in time with the time time watch thing and rescues Peter, but doesn't rescue anyone else. He goes just just go home, Peter. Just go home. And I thought that was really funny. And I know there's a Twitter account just for the character. I really I just watched. Found it out because of a video. Anyway, um, there's a scene after the credits where Deadpool and Negus 19 and Warhead fix Cable's time time watch thing, and then Deadpool uses the time travel, which leads me into my next point. There's a scene when um, Deadpool, after the credits, obviously, um, kills shitty Deadpool from X Men Origins. You know, the one with his mouth showed shut. Yeah, he kills that version of Deadpool. He kills him a few times, and like talks to Wolverine, goes. He goes, I hope you don't die, or something like that. I forget exactly what Deadpool says in the credit scene. I mean, um, I gotta see it for a second time to remember that. Then Deadpool goes to Ryan Reynolds, the real Ryan Reynolds, looking at the Green Lantern scope, and kills Ryan Reynolds. And then that was just freaking hilarious. I laughed my ass off. And that's about it. There's some other spoilers, like, um, I want to talk about. I think I talked about all of them. I don't want to talk about all the spoilers, because I want to save some for the movie, if you guys haven't seen the movie yet. Or if you guys have seen it, I just kind of left them out. Because I did. Because my memory. I couldn't remember the, any of the others. But, yeah. These are the ones I I uh, put in. Anyway. Deadpool 2 was great. I give it a 9.5 out of 10. Definitely going to see it again. Loved it. And, yeah. If you want to... Well, this video will be up soon. I think. And I might play some Fortnite. Because I haven't played in a few days. And my Xbox is acting up. Like I mentioned the other day. I think I did. And, yeah. And there's also I mentioned there's a there's a uh, scene in Deadpool two when um, Dead when C Cable's attacking the prison with Russell and Deadpool and, and Deadpool has the uh, collar on and the cancer's coming back and it's slowly killing him and uh Deadpool and Colossus are fighting and, or Deadpool and Cable not Colossus and um Cable says stabs him in the neck it was so dark you're not sure you're from the DC universe and when he said that I was laughing so hard. And Duke Pender made a really was really funny. I love the one at the end when um Deadpool referenced him as a brown panther, making fun of Black Panther. There was a lot of MCU references to it in the movie too, which I really liked. Like I think he made fun of um Donald being a black, a black black widow. You get it, you get it, because he, she's black. Anyway, the movie was really funny. I loved it. And I'm trying to think of what other MCU references there were. I think there was one too. I feel like there's a Spider Man reference somewhere in there. But anyway, that's my spoiler review. I'm done. I'm going to post this video soon, edit it, and then, yeah, I'll post it on YouTube in a little bit. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is Charlo signing out, and, uh, yeah, don't forget to comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you want, and, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.